Saab's new T-7A fighter trainer aircraft manufacturing facility is in Purdue's Discovery Park District. It's a smart factory. General Manager Robert Uliberry says that means it was digitally designed. We have a full 3D simulation of our facility, uh, which allowed us, through repetition, to model different scenarios uh, for volume and capacity planning before we ever placed a PO for, for equipment. And he says the plant is fully connected. Key performance indicators will constantly monitor the manufacturing process from the materials being shipped in to the finished product going out. That information flows seamlessly without the use of paper and we're able to measure real-time real analytics um, to identify trends in safety, quality, cost, delivery and morale. Autonomous robots will move materials through the facility and the production line will be two stories tall. Essentially place the uh, aft uh, overhead of the people on the first floor so that they can access the underside of it for assembly operations. And then our teammates on the top of the platforms will be able to do the work on top of the aircraft. Representatives of Saab and Purdue University both say the beauty of this site is not only the close proximity to Purdue's airport, but also to the Zucro labs. They're just a short walk away from Saab's plant. Purdue Senior Vice President of Alliances and Placemaking Greg Deason says researchers and students at Zucro Laboratories are conducting cutting-edge research, testing materials, and designing propulsion systems. Not only do you have those things happening there, but uh, the talent that's being produced there is world-renowned, and that gives us great opportunities for that talent to stay right here in our community. With this project, Sweden-based Saab says it becomes an American company as well. The plant will manufacture aircraft for the U.S. Air Force pilot training program in partnership with Boeing. Eula Berry says 50 employees, many of whom are U.S. military veterans, are on staff. Saab expects to hire another 35 people by the end of the year. Learn more about the open positions online at Saab.com. Chris Morissi Visa, Star City News, West Lafayette.